Oh, wow. Look, his friend. Oh! Oh, I just witnessed that on camera. You, sir, are gross. <laughs> Hello stars, this is Jason, and today I got an awesome video for you guys. It's the Minions Mod Showcase Mod Review thingy, and it's uh, pretty cool. Uh, it just adds some minions into your game, kind of like Despicable Me. Yeah, I mean, you tell them what to do, and you're an evil master. So it's super fun, and I just hope you guys enjoy it. If you do, make sure you slap the like button. Let's see if we can get mm, 4,000 likes on this episode. Um, but other than that, you guys, enjoy the video. I will see you there. Hey guys, Jason here, and welcome back to another Minecraft mod review. It's, it, Minecraft matters. It matters. I'm going to go ahead and throw Minecraft in there because it just matters. So um, let's go ahead and get started, you guys. This is the Minions mod. Um, I, I hope you guys know this mod. If you're watching my Attack of the B-Team series, this is one of the mods, which is kind of why I'm reviewing it. So that way a lot of you guys can know all the, the details on, the, on, the, on this mod. So um, let's go ahead and get started. Um, minions can do lots of things for you. Um, they can follow you around, they can be sent to places, they can chop down trees, they can mine, mine shafts, they can do lots of things. So I'm guessing you're wanting to see these minions, right? Well, um, they're only, um, obtained a certain way, which I mean, you know, makes sense, but it's a very unique way. Uh, you can only get them by being level 8, pretty much. So get to level 8, I'm level 17, because... You just cuz cuz I want to be um, and yeah, uh, so once you get to level 8 press M on your keyboard Which is the default minions key and you'll see a little picture here called commit to evil a little button um, If you're not level 8, you'll just see never mind so the darkness listens commit to evil So let's commit to evil you guys. Um, what should I do? That's very evil make a dinner should I taunt the liberals or should I become a pop smash star? I think we should become a Pop Smash star, that's pretty evil. Um, and so, that something happens, like a little effect just like this. Oh wow, I'm becoming a Pop Smash star and then my blindness goes away. Wow, that was so evil. Um, we're gonna commit to evil once more. As you can see, my levels went down two levels. This is why you have to be level eight, because you have to do this four times. So, um, what should we do this time? Spawn Satanist cult? <laughs> Disturb burial ceremony? Um, or taunt the liberals again? Let's, let's spawn a Satanist cult, that's pretty, uh, pretty evil. Uh, I don't I don't know who would even have that ability, but it's pretty evil. This is a really cool, nice world too. Wow, beautiful. Nice chicken. Beautiful nice chicken. You look great, chicken. You look great. Oh wow. Look his friend. Oh! Oh, I just witnessed that on camera. You sir are gross. Wow, he's invincible too? Yeah, you get out of here, you little weirdo. Alright, let's keep let's move on. Um, let's keep committing to evil. Commit to evil. Talk demon tongue? Sp hold dark ma- oh, spread sun to teachings? I don't know what any of this means. What's a hold dark mess mean? I'm gonna speak demon tongue. It sounds pretty evil. Alright, so that's my third time. Let's go ahead and do it again. Pass gas in someone's face? That sounds fun. Oh wow, that's so evil. Now that I've committed to evil four times, I now have what's called a master's staff. Look at this baby. I can punch stuff with it and lightning comes out. It's pretty sick actually. What's up? Let's keep moving on. Let's move on to um, actually spawning in these little minion guys. So basically, um, you can right click your staff on the ground and bam, one minion pops out. But wait, you have four minions because you committed evil four times. So um, yes, you right click. Well, am I really that hungry? Wow, let's switch into game mode and get some get some steaks or something. Yeah, there we go, some nice steaks. I'm gonna go eat steak tonight after I record. <laughs> Sounds good. All right, let me just eat up these steaks here because I wanna be in game mode when I do all this. So, um, left click the master item for lightning bolts, like I said, right click to spawn minions. Pretty simple. Right click to issue orders for your minions. Um, and that's like context sensitive, so it's like a place, a tree, or an animal or like an ore vein, or like your feet. So, um, let's change the time back to zero. Um, so if I right click the ground, and my feet, um, <laughs> one of the minions will pick me up, and I can simply just right click the ground where I want them to go. It's pretty sick, actually, in case you, you know, you know, whenever you have minions, you don't walk, you know? It's just it's a fact, you just don't walk. So we're gonna go over here and we're gonna kill this chicken, because he sucked earlier. What's up, chicken? Mm -hmm. And with the help of my minions, I could do so. Thanks, minions. Oh, uh, and if you guys notice, actually, when I killed that chicken, it gave me roasted chicken. 
So that's pretty cool. It actually, the lightning actually cooks meat. So that's pretty cool. That's fun. It's fun to kill, kill stuff and get some cooked meat. So um, yeah, moving on. Um, so if well, let's go, let's go tell them to chop down a tree over there. So if I right click that tree, they're gonna head over to that tree. They're gonna head, get that egg. Yeah, that's right. Um, so they also pick up items too. So they're gonna chop down this tree until it's pretty much all gone. So yeah, they're pretty dang cool. It really beats just you know mining the tree yourself. So moving on. Uh, as you can see, they're just gonna mine this tree. It looks like they're doing it really slow. I think they do it all at once, maybe, because I see nothing happening. You gonna you gonna chop down that tree there, minion? Maybe you can only chop down normal trees. Cause these are weird trees. Let's go tell them to chop down that tree right there. That's a little baby tree. So this is a little a tree. It might it might take less time. So a more little. There we go. Okay, so it is all at once. So you just gotta give them a little while, and that big old bulky tree will be chopped down. Within time, within time. Same works for ore veins as well. You can right click ore veins, pretty simple. Well, this is weird. Why is there a bunch of sheeps in a, bu a random place? These are, what the heck's going on here? Ha, 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 I right clicked a sheep and they picked up the sheep. Look at them, they're bringing the sheep to me. Oh my God, that's hilarious. I just right clicked another sheep. It's like right over here somewhere. Let's, let's tell them to pick up this guy. Maybe they'll pick up this guy too. All right, pick up this sheep right now. Pick up this sheep. Yes, yes, I mean, just transfer animals like that. That's so funny. I could bring Jeffrey. I could bring Jeffrey if I wanted to move him for whatever reason. That's so cool. Yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all they do with the right click. Um, but there is other things that can happen. So if you press M, you can um, do lots of other mini things. You can dig a mine shaft. You can unsummon your minions, which I will do right now. And for some reason, it teleported me to them. Um, but I unsummoned my minions. Um, and now basically to get them back it's just one, two, three, and then four. So now they're all here, fresh. Um, and so let's, let's, let's have them dig a mine shaft, shall we? So, um, we click dig mine shaft and, uh, we pretty much choose what, uh, what location we want them to start mining at. Let's just go ahead and, uh, right click the ground right there. And then BAM! BAM! Mine shaft going down. And they even build stairs and everything. The most ultimate thing. Look how, look how good they are, too. So fast. They'll install stairs and everything. And they'll pick up all the ores and everything by the end and all the blocks they're actually mining. And they will give them to you. They will drop them um, for you when you right-click them. If you want them to go faster, just slap them with your lightning. Like, left-click them and then they will just go faster. It's like punishing them. It's funny. Um, but, yeah. Uh, right click chest from a distance to set it as a destination is what the form says So let's pull out a chest here. Let's see what we can do with a chest Okay, I had to tell them to start digging again. It was weird. Their mine shaft got interrupted But what I want to show you guys is if you right click a chest from a distance They will put all the stuff um, They gathered inside that chest so um, but it's kind of weird because kind of halts their mining and stuff You know for those few that did that those other guys are still mining, but I don't know. It's, it's a little weird. Mine shafts are a little weird. You have to do them the right way. But yeah, that, that's how you can pretty much gather their stuff if you want it done an easier way without them dropping it or whatever. So check this out. You can actually um, charge your staff like it's a bow, and your minions will follow you. Come this way, minions. This way. This way. No, they won't do it. They're all they're digging their mine shaft. we got to come upstairs. Come upstairs. This way. Minions, you suck. I'm going to unsummon you so hard. Okay, I unsummoned them, but check it out. They will follow me if I right click. Come this way, minions. Well, they follow you anyways, so. But if they're doing something, you can have them follow you by canceling it, by right clicking or whatever. So, um, yeah. Also, for the mine shaft, uh, if you want to change the dimensions of your mine shaft, uh, both width and height, uh, you can do so by uh, changing the numbers here. And just click make it so, and then it will be about that big. And then you can reset dimensions easily just by clicking reset and it'll be back to normal. So that's a really cool a way to customize it. The last thing to show is a strip mine. It's easily done by holding M or pressing M and clicking strip mine. And then um, you can strip mine. You just right click it as if it was a mine shaft and they will begin digging a strip mine, which is basically just a straight line. And they'll just go on forever, I feel like. Um, you got to keep up with them. I, I'm pretty sure. But uh, yeah, they will start digging a uh, bunch of uh, bunch of bunch of ores out and whatnot, and then you'll have lots of cool stuff if you just want them to go straight. Say you've dig, uh, dug your mine shaft all the way down to the bottom. Wow, this guy's trapped down here. 
Um, say you've dug your mine shaft all the way down to the bottom and you need to go straight. That's what a strip mine's for. So, I mean, that's pretty much it, you guys. Uh, let's get our minions back out here. They're the coolest. Um, let's end off the episode with them. So it's really cool. It's like Despicable Me. You can add uh, add your own little minions, and they they you're their master, their evil master. It's so cool. So um, it's a very thought out mod. It's made by the same guy who made the Pet Bats mod, which is Dylan Ultimate ultimate guy probably makes lots of other good mods we haven't covered yet so uh yeah maybe be sure to check out all his other mods in this mod by going to the link in the description other than that guys slap that like button if you enjoyed and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already because we got minecraft content like every day so other than that guys i will talk to you stars later and see you guys